Nirvana to me was always a threesome. And then when Kurt said, let's bring Pat into Nirvana, were you shocked? Were you like, no, 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 it's the three of us. Was it weird no. for you to, to become a foursome? No. Well, you know, uh, Nirvana at one point had another guitarist like in... 1989 or 1990, this dude named Jason Everman was in the band for a bit. And then they went back to being a three-piece. So it didn't seem weird to me. Um, Kurt, we had just made this record, and Kurt's like, I feel like we need another guitar player to fill out some of the guitar parts. And the craziest thing was that, you know, Pat comes from... Pat's from Los Angeles and was in this legendary punk rock band called The, the Germs. Germs yeah. That we all grew up listening to. Like, we worshipped The Germs. And, you know, we were talking about other guitar players. Kurt comes back from Los Angeles. He's like, I found our second guitar player. I'm like, who? He said, Pat Smear from the Germs. And I was just like, honestly, my first reaction was like, that guy's still alive? Really? <laughs> like, if you only knew, like, what the Germs yeah. did and what they were like. And then he walks in, he's Pat Smear, like, hey! And it, I mean, uh, for the last year of the band, it was like, it made the band a lot more fun to be in, having Pat in the band. Was it weird for you? I mean, to go into a band that's tied already and then have to join them like later in the game. I would think it's kind of it's kind of cool, but it also kind of sucks because you got to get up to speed with these guys. It was only weird immediately, and then it got cool real fast. And uh, what was I weird? Like first, I your first gig was SNL. Yeah, <laughs> right out of the gate, <laughs> from on the stage at SNL. Right there it is. <laughs> was Kurt that kind of guy? Like he's like, hey Pat, just come on SNL with us. Yeah. He, yeah. he just called me up and said, you want to be in my band? I'm like, okay. I've met him, I don't know, once or twice. I didn't know him at all. I knew Courtney. So uh, I guess she gave me an endorsement. So you didn't have to audition. I mean, like, what happens? No. Like, so for the first Pat gig, Smear. yeah, I know he's Pat Smear, but Jesus Christ, we got to at least see. Oh, yeah, I guess you're right. I mean, it would be insulting. <laughs> I Pat asked Smear. the same question. Like, what right. if they don't like me? And he said, right. yeah, it'll be fine. I'd be all paranoid. Yeah. I mean, to be honest, when Pat joined the band, he was the best musician in Nirvana, you know? <laughs> so it's not like he wasn't joining, like, the Philharmonic Orchestra. It was like, you know, he was already overqualified. Why do you say that, though? I mean, you're, I would think Am I wrong? Savant Pat Smear, or something. am I wrong? You're wrong. <laughs> I am not wrong. Dave, are you not a great musician? I mean, do you Pat, not see yourself as a what's the story you told me once, Pat, about you guys, walk, you and Kurt walking by Dave playing... Kurt's left-handed guitar. Yeah, Dave, we're, we're backstage at a gig once, and Dave's noodling around the guitar, and me and Kurt walk by, and we stare at him for a minute, and we go in the next room, and we started laughing. We're like, oh, my God, he's better than both of us. Oh. <laughs> <laughs>